Hello and welcome. We are revealing the legendary Lord. I'd like to thank Everguild for giving me this opportunity. Thank you. On the Warforge website, we've got the Tower Empire pre-sale kits. I know, I know, I know, I know, I know. The starter bundles, five boosters, premium, 30 Australian dollars. I'm, I'm going to probably pre-order this. Yeah, yeah, I'm going to do this. Shit. There's also the, um, you know, Big Daddy pack, a couple of cosmetics, card bag, avatar icon. Is there a title? Free themed Tau Cosmetics Redeemed into Yeah, there's going to be a title. I, d I don't know what it is. Maybe Commander? Who knows? The titles are shit. Who cares? But yeah, you have 30 packs. $80 Australian. Yeah, yeah. Pass. Pass for me. I am not that rich. Sorry. Sorry. And here is Commander Shadow Sun. Hero of the Third Sphere. 2-2, 40 HP. Pretty great. Its spell is give Mark Light 1 to an enemy troop or plus 1 range attack this turn to a friendly unit. In my opinion, the hero that gives plus one health to all the boys is going to be a better hero. But I have not played with Marker Light yet, so we'll have to see how it plays out before we can fully judge this. Give plus two range attack or plus two health to a friendly unit. It's it's pretty average. Pretty average. Deal two damage to all enemies, plus an additional two damage to each enemy of Marker Light. This is really good. Two cost troop, free health, one melee, two range, it's pretty average, but rally. Give Mark Light 2 to an enemy troop, companion 2, Mark a drone. This is pretty good. Like 2 cost, just slapping Mark Light 2 on a troop. This is going to cause some damage. The Mark a drone, 2 cost, zero, 1, free health, flying. At the start of your turn, give Mark Light 1 to a random enemy. With the cost reduction you can give to drones, this could be good. The other hero we've seen so far, you know, 2-2, two, two, 35 health. Give plus 1 health to your units. This is just going to be so solid, so powerful. I feel this is going to be the best hero. Also, you create a copy of, you know, choose an invocation, put in your hand, it costs one less. You know, I don't know, like, if you'd play both cards, but even just giving plus one health to all your units for one cost, you know, it's solid, it's massive, it's huge. I feel this will be my deck, my first tower deck that I, like, want to make, you know? Bunch of drones, bunch of buffs for the boys, spreading the health. You know, plus one health to all the boys is great. I love it. I can't wait. Three cost, stun an enemy, give it Mark Light 1. I, I, I feel this is not that great. We'll see how Mark Light plays out. I have not tried it yet. It, it seems pretty average, like a weak version of Vulnerable. But um, I could be wrong on this, and it might be really good. You can also give it to their hero. Give Mark Light 3 to an enemy troop. If it already had Mark Light, destroy it instead. Three cost for an instant removal. This is good. Give long range to your units. This is solid. This is really good. This is a great card. Give Mark Light 2 to an enemy. Four cost. Doesn't seem that good great for a four cost we'll see how it plays seven cost draw three cards lower the cost buy one when an enemy dies i feel i'll be using this in my deck but i don't like the seven cost if you draw it late in the game one cost zero melee one range free health vanguard you know just a little cheap shield easy two cost zero one range free health flying at the start of your turn deal two damage to a random enemy i love that random ping damage we'll see how it plays flying at the start of your turn give mark light one to a random enemy this is good this is how i want to give the mark light from the drones this is how i want the deck to play a lot of drones few vanguard keep the boys alive spread the bark light random pings from the drones it sounds fun to me i can't wait to try it three cost one melee four range three health flying long range yeah he's, he's all right he's all right he's good he's, if it didn't have the flying it would be trash but it's got flying it's okay you know three cost free 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 hp vanguard you know it will shield the boys it's solid three cost zero two five health at the start of your turn deal two damage to all enemies this card is absolutely nuts i love it as long as it lives a turn legend you know if it dies it did shit four cost two melee five range five health i feel that the melee is very lacking chaos is gonna clap all over the tau empire and i kind of looking forward for that the harakin deck is common solid but um companion ds8 turret that is the aoe damage turret we just went over like, dropping this guy and then that turret together, like, that is solid. Like, 5 health, 5 damage, like, you've got to pick which one you're killing. 5 cost, 3 melee, 6 range, 5 health, 1 armor. Long range, companion 2 missile drone. And the missile drone is at 2 cost, 0, 2, 3, blast 2, this is solid. That's going to cause some damage, if it lives. We'll see how they play. You know, I haven't tried it yet, can't wait. 5 cost, 2 melee, 4 range, 5 health, stealth. When you deploy a drone, give it plus 1 range attack. Rally, give Michael out for 
three to an enemy troop. This is great. This will be fun. Buff up the boys. It's got stealth. You know, it's not dying. It's got five health. It's, it's strong. Six cost, five melee, seven range, six health. Dang God. Adjacent units have plus one range attack. Companion two, Guardian drone. We went over the Guardian drone. That is the little taunt boys. So playing that, if you've got the cost reduction to um drop the Vanguard, that's just going to be a lot of tanks. I like it. Solid. You, this is going to be a staple card. Every tower deck for sure. One cost. Give shield to a friendly unit. Great card. Absolutely great card. Staple. One cost. Staple. Two cost. Give plus one armor to your troops. You know, all the troops getting plus one armor, this could be amazing. We'll see how it plays. I like the shield better though. Not sure you'd want both in the deck, but I don't know. Plus one armor to all the troops is awesome. Three cost. Give plus two range attack to your units this turn. I feel like this is going to play out like the, um the orcs how you get all the buffs of the boys and you don't end up putting it in the deck but um we'll see how it plays I'm not sure legendary troop six cost six melee four range seven health shield your troops cost one less like this is what i'm saying about the drones if you can get the cost reduction down stuff like this you know it's going to be amazing staples if he lives through the turn you know you get the choose an invocation and put it in your hand it costs one less obviously you'll get the choice between free cards this could be good you know getting the shield costing zero plus one armor to all your troops costing one as of the other cards this can create we'll have to wait till the faction is completely revealed before we can like judge how good this is going to be but so far it sounds amazing you know as long as all the cards are low cost and you've got a choice between three like solid two cost deal free damage little cheeky ping solid gunship seven health three melee eight range seven health long range i feel this needs flying it seems pretty shit legendary three cost choose a troop in your deck draw it lower its cost by three right however i believe this is going to play sort of like the black crusade how it doesn't draw the troop out of your deck it creates a copy so you can get dupes of your legendaries and 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 it's going to lower the cost by Free, which is huge obviously you'll have a choice between free cards you're most likely going to get a drone have it cost zero however if you can pull the other legendary stealth rally give stealth to your two adjacent drones like this is just absolutely solid if you can combo that or this boom you know Dreams are made of this. And if he lives the turn, which he most likely will because he has stealth and free health, you know, you're drawing the two cost. Give Mark Light 2 to an enemy. Solid. Strong. Battle suit. Eight cost. Three melee. Eight range. Nine health. Shield. Long range. Talent. Shield generation. Give shield to a friendly battle suit. I don't know. Yeah, I don't know. I kind of feel this card is bad. You know, eight cost. You play him. He doesn't do a thing. He does not have flank. He does not have flying. He's got free melee. He's just gonna get shit on. Okay, one of the big daddy cards. Free cost. Your drones cost one less for the rest of this battle. Not for the turn, for the entire battle. Oh, I can't wait to play this. Come on, my little drones. Be my new scarabs. I hope you play well. Two cost. Flying stealth at the end of your turn, give stealth to an adjacent troop, not both, just one. So, you know, if you play this on an end adjacent, guaranteed the stealth on what you want it to be. I like this. And then he's most likely dead next turn. But if you can keep this alive or if, you know, a bunch of taunt, it, it could cause some havoc. I don't know. We'll see how it plays. I like drones. Keep them coming. Five cost. Deploy three random drones and give them Vanguard. Normally, I don't like the deploy random troop cards. They're pretty bad, but five cost, three drones. Let's do it. Let's go.